Google Account Verification FRP, is a crucial security measure on Android phones running version 5.1 and above, preventing unauthorized users from accessing your device post-factory reset. If you have a Google account associated with your Samsung device, this feature is automatically activated. Despite its benefits, FRP can also be annoying, especially when you forget your Google account password or encounter issues with your Samsung phone being locked after a factory reset. But don't worry, today's three solutions will help you solve your problems. In the first method, you just need to open the settings and then go to the account and backup option. Click on the account that you want to remove from your device. Just click on the option. It may ask you to enter the lock screen password after which your Google account will be removed from your Samsung device. After successfully deleting the account, your device will not be bothered by FRP lock. The second method can solve the problem of how to remove FRP lock when you forget the device password or cannot access the device. But your Samsung device should also be logged into a Google account and Google's Find My Device option is enabled. You can remove the FRP lock on your Samsung through your Google account. 1. Use another device log into Google Find My Device and enter your Google account details. 2. Select your FRP locked Samsung device and click on the Erase Device option in the left column. All data on your Samsung device, including your password, will be erased. If you purchased a secondhand Samsung device, then obviously the previous two methods will not help you. We strongly recommend DroidKit to you. It's a comprehensive toolkit for Android devices that safely removes Samsung's FRP lock. In addition, it can unlock Android lock screens, upgrade systems, recover lost data, and fix system errors. 1. Free download DroidKit on your PC or Mac and launch it, then click the FRP bypass option from the interface. 2. Connect your Samsung device to your PC using a USB cable and click start. Then you need to choose the device brand. 3. DroidKit will prepare a configuration file for your device, therefore, don't unplug your phone during the process. After that, Click on Start to Bypass. 4. Select your Android system version from the given options and click Next. 5. Continue following the on-screen instructions on the DroidKit interface to complete some settings on your device. First connect to Wi-Fi then back to Hello screen on your phone, then tap on the Emergency Call button. Enter the string, phone will jump to the factory mode automatically. Click on the Reset button on the app then your phone will ask for USB debugging. Allow it then DroidKit will start to bypass FRP Samsung now. Please wait for a second and don't unplug your device. 6. Now your Samsung FRP is bypassed successfully and your phone will reboot automatically. DroidKit is user-friendly and can remove FRP locks and Google accounts on Samsung devices in minutes without needing technicians. It supports Android 6 and above, works with brands like Samsung, Xiaomi, Redmi, Poco, and Sony, ensuring a high success rate. With advanced encryption technology, it is 100% safe, malware free, and protects your privacy in device security. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. See you next time.